Before we go ahead and check out the other buildings, this thing just caught my attention in the very, very back of the property, guys. What in the world is this? Check it out. <laughs> to a brand new video i hope you guys are all having a fantastic day today ladies and gentlemen we are once again back on roblox blocksburg for another episode of subscriber tours you guys might be able to tell from our outfit and a little bit of uh, what you can see in the background that today we are going to be touring another special themed build built by merly twirly this lovely lady right over here to my left side but anyways guys Guys, before we go ahead and begin i gotta give a huge shout out to all the people joining me for the intro really fast we got riley Murley, we got moly k coolins and cw fletch hanging out for the intro thank you guys so much now before we go ahead and begin with today's tour make sure you guys all take a quick second right now go ahead and smash that freaking like button if you guys are inspired at any time at all please show Murley some love down in the comment sections below i absolutely love doing these subscriber tours for you guys i hope you enjoy today Today's episode all right guys so right behind us we are going to be touring this wild west called the dusty tracks built by merly twirly it's very rare that we actually get to tour a wild west town over here and it's actually quite interesting because each and every single one of these buildings that you guys see behind me are actually going to be fully decorated out so we've got a lot to tour today guys i hope you guys do enjoy and without further ado let's go ahead and uh, start off the tour with as always a little bit of bird's eye view of the entire wild west town as you guys can see the entire plot is used you guys can kind of see how there's like a bunch of dirt piles and stuff everywhere as well the really cool part is if you go into first person mode guys there's a bunch of fog machines randomly placed throughout the entire property so it actually looks like there's like a whole bunch of like weird like fog or like misty sand kind of like you know going across the entire town oh my gosh i can already imagine a whole bunch of tumbleweeds just kind of going through through town and somebody is just waiting to have a little bit of like a, a face off or something like that you know what i'm saying oh my gosh all right guys very very first thing that we are going to go ahead and check out today we've got a, a barber shop over here a little bit of a barber shop as you guys might be able to imagine you guys can come on over here <gasps> wait what the heck guys wanted dead or alive wait that kind of looks like me. Wait, what? That kind of looks like my old character right there, dude. What in the world? It's a good thing uh, we've got a different outfit on today because uh, today I'm Sheriff D Field, and uh, that uh, that's definitely. That's definitely not me, guys. That's definitely not me. But looking into this quick little barbershop, guys, you guys might be able to imagine somebody would sit down right there where Riley was just chilling at, get a haircut, get their beard all lined up and shaved. This is an awesome recreation of a barbershop here on Bloxburg, guys. Absolutely freaking amazing. Right next door, guys, we do have the sheriff station right over here. Okay, okay. Guys, a lot more wanted posters for all of these, uh, this weird person. And I'm not quite sure if that's me or not, but okay, hey, I'm telling you guys. I'm, I'm, I'm innocent, okay? I'm innocent. I'm innocent, man. <laughs> Anyways, guys, inside the sheriff station, as you guys might be able to imagine, you've got a little bit of an office over here for the sheriff of the entire town, and then a couple of nice little jail cells if anybody is actually, you know, needing to go in here and uh, be put in here for the night. Oh my gosh, this jail cell is so freaking cool looking. A nice little use of these uh, sort of like pillars in order to kind of make this jail cell very, very well done. Now, before we go ahead and leave the sheriff, station guys make sure you pay close attention to this little uh wanted poster wall because you guys can see we can make a lot of money if we find this guy and then this person right here wait what the heck ten thousand dollars if we end up finding this person dead or alive oh my goodness an awesome little stand for all of you guys out there that are trying to look or build into this more of a western style i hope that this build is giving you guys a little bit of inspiration to actually uh you know start your western themed builds i don't know about you guys but i feel like merly has done a really really good job into actually creating a western sort of world over here now i don't know if any of you guys have watched the show called westworld on hbo but literally walk 
walking into this saloon right over here guys it feels like i'm walking into that more of like a western style vibe i've probably got some like western old western music playing in the background of the video right now just so you guys can fit into the mood but oh my gosh back in the day guys there was probably a whole lot of shenanigans going on in the saloon where people were gambling in the background drinking a whole lot of booze you're walking in here making sure that we have every single possible pint of beer that we could possibly drink you know what i'm saying oh my gosh this is an awesome town i could definitely see people role playing in this actual western town itself oh my gosh this is freaking awesome you know what guys one little drink for the road <laughs> oh i absolutely freaking love this build so far guys if you haven't already smashed that freaking like button what the heck are you doing smash that freaking like button right now guys it's just been so freaking awesome yeehaw <laughs> now across from the saloon right next door to the sheriff's house i'm not exactly sure what whoa i think this is like a gun shop or like the weapon shop or something there's like knives and weapons all across the entire thing as you guys might be able to imagine those are like guns on the wall sort of like on the racks and then over here these are like all the ammo boxes and stuff what the heck what you guys saw right there is the gun shop guys basically with a little bit of imagination you guys can kind of see some of those custom decorations could look like guns here on freaking Bloxburg absolutely freaking love it now we do have a couple more things to check out over here guys these are more like the one bedroom residence that you guys might be able to expect to see here in an actual uh, Western town You know, these are the places that people probably rent out for you know little stays or maybe the people the towns people that actually live here uh, Sort of live close by into these actual uh, sort of hotels I guess you could say so this is the main hotel of this entire Western town walking inside guys a bunch of wanted posters as you guys might be able to imagine but anyway guys look at this little room over here definitely a different feeling and a different vibe from what we can see from the outside so Merle probably just wanted to decorate this a little bit uh you know a little bit more livelier than the actual western theme itself but it still fits in to the actual western style what do you guys think oh my gosh standing into the corner guys you guys might be able to imagine how much time and effort this must have taken to actually decorate everything out to this just amazing amazing freaking quality even the bathrooms themselves guys they still feel like you know they still feel like they're in that you know sort of western sort of style now right in the dead center of town guys we do have a little bit of a custom watchtower or like a clock tower i guess that you might be able to imagine is inside any of these western towns if any of you guys have ever watched any of those old movies like those old western movies there's always a clock in the middle of the town that just strikes 12 and then you know everything goes freaking wild a nice little custom tower over here guys you guys can actually even walk inside and just sort of have a little bit of a look at how the inner circles or the inner workings of this clock tower actually works so you guys might be able to imagine that is a bell right over there and every single hour that bell actually dings the top of the hour boom right over there on that clock oh my gosh so far so good this has probably been one of the most thorough western builds that i have toured here on blocksburg absolutely freaking love it now across from everything so there's the old west inn we have ourselves i'm assuming this is like a bakery or like maybe like um, a, a convenience store of some sort because you guys can kind of see they can sell fruit over here There's a whole bunch of clothes over here that you guys may be able to purchase We do have a whole bunch of fruit and stuff. Whoa, Riley donating me $40,000. What the heck Riley? Thank you so much for that. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my gosh What the heck Merle did just say that all of these little jars over here guys a little bit of imagination These are different types of candy you can buy at this store dude check it out Let me go ahead and stand in the corner really quickly because some of you guys out there are trying to build a bunch of shops and everything like that just check out the types of decorations and the different sorts of colors Merle uses in this sort of like western style of a shop and just look how well everything sort of fits in together now guys we are not yet done with the tour we've got a couple more buildings to go ahead and check out but before we go ahead and check out the other buildings this thing just caught my attention in the very very back of the property guys what in the world is this check 
it out. A fully custom built train here on Blocksburg. It's even life size. You guys can walk into each one of these carriages, sort of sit down and imagine that you guys are in a carriage, you know, somewhere in the middle of the United States going towards California or something like that. The train tracks are even leading off of the property into elsewhere and on that side as well. It takes a lot of creativity and a lot of time to come up with custom designs just like this on actual Blocksburg guys. So I have to commend Mer if you haven't already smashed the like button for this build this has to go ahead and actually just tip it over guys take a quick second right now go ahead and smash it guys you guys can even walk into the cockpit of the actual train itself and sort of drive the train just like any other locomotive pilot would what in the world wait there's even an engine room guys for the coal you guys can always imagine back in the day when there were coal engines here on trains a bunch of workers would be sitting over here and just piling a whole bunch of coal into the fire to actually start the freaking train wow dude what an amazing freaking build merly that's got to be one of the best custom designs that i've seen here on blocksburg i do have to freaking say what in the heck all right guys a couple more buildings to go ahead and check out over here so let's go ahead and speed on through these we've got a stable over here on the far side you guys might be able to imagine a whole bunch of horses being kept over here for any of the townspeople that might just need a horse in order to travel a little bit further down we've got ourselves whoa what is this this looks like a little bit of like a like a furnace room or something so this might be the room where oh yes this is the anvil room where people are going to be like smithing a whole bunch of like weapons and steel items right over here dude a lot of these custom rooms with the different texturing it actually works so freaking well with some of the new industrial equipment this looks absolutely freaking amazing and then last but not least guys on the very far end of the block we do have a little bit of a bank over here what is inside this bank is there anything to crazy oh my gosh guys walking into this bank okay imagine this with me right now we were we're a little bit of an outlaw we walk into the bank and we're like hands up hands up put the money in the bag <laughs> oh my gosh you guys can imagine it right now this entire bank is just made to be held up you know what i'm saying oh my gosh the money is on the table ready for us to take guys oh my goodness she's like ah don't hurt me <laughs> i would never hurt you guys don't worry don't worry it's just a prank it's just a prank i kid i kid <laughs> Oh my gosh, they even have closing tellers right in the very front. Absolutely freaking amazing. Guys, if you want to take the time and the effort to actually make one of these sorts of like really fun themes here on Blocksburg, you guys can definitely build something where you will have a lot of fun role playing inside of it. And for me personally, I think Merley's sort of Western town is literally just one of the best sorts of builds for a role playing sort of scenario. So last but not least, guys, we do have a couple more buildings to check over here we've got a little bit of a sermon room this is probably like a church or a gathering area and then last but not least the church is right over here with obviously a little bit of a graveyard towards the back side oh my gosh guys i'm telling you with a little bit of time and effort you can literally build almost any type of build that you can possibly imagine here on blocksburg it just takes a little bit of time and creativity to go ahead and build something as amazing as this once again guys a huge shout out to merly twirly and of course purple monkey for actually helping out with the build itself we do want to go ahead and hit up the outro of the video as always guys i do hope you guys enjoyed today's subscriber tours episode here on Blocksburg. A quick shout out to everybody hanging out at the very end of the video. We got Riley, Merley Prime, and Molly Cake. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. My name is D-Field. We'll see you guys again tomorrow for another daily Roblox video. Have a fantastic day, everybody. Peace.